So yeah, I've got a few places I need to give away. Um, King's House, I'm probably going to give to his brother. Going to give it to Benford Stark. Yeah, I think that's the best thing to do. Let's give it to you. I cannot give it to you. Where are you? You are in the north. So I can't, Okay. I want to give it to you, but I can't apparently. Because, uh, yeah, that's annoying. Actually, in fact, let's sort out all the problems first. Okay. De jure claims. Okay, the rills and the sea guard. Okay, they're all back in. And now I've got old stones. Damn it. God damn it, old stones. And because I've erased levy, that is, that's ridiculous. Ah, so we're going to do that all over again. Very frustrating. That was going to be our home. Any more armies about? Nope. Colonize old stones. And there we go. And I'll send my steward, isn't it? We need to send the steward down there. Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, I'll send an army down there, don't I? Where is an army? Oh. I might as well actually just raise everyone and send the closest one. Let's have a look, who's the closest? And we've got one right there. So I'll send you guys up. And then once you're there, we'll stop. I can't believe that stops it though. That's really annoying. <laughs> oh. What is this? The guards drag Lara Bolton up from her cell and throw her at your feet. I've come for justice, she says. By right of birth and blood, I demand trial by combat. Our lyric Flint will be my champion. She's, she's chosen a flint, okay. Who's Alaric Flint? I can't, really, I can't bother to look for him, to be honest. Okay, you have that right. I'll, ex I'll select someone to stand for his king. I am just and kind, so I'll allow that. Okay. Who should be my champion in the trial by combat against Lara Bolton? Okay. Could use a little. He's not particularly... He's an okay fighter, but not, he's a bit of a craven actually as well. <laughs> that doesn't really help. He's about the same, but he's not a craven. So I'm going to go with him. He'll fight bravely. Wish there was someone else I could choose from. It, like I said, it'd be really cool if you could make your own like King's Guard, like Renly did with the Rainbow Guard. That would be really awesome. Um, Shale of Honey Pond steps forward. I'll stand for you, Your Grace. Fight well, Shale. Fight well. You watch with glee as Shale of Honey Pond drives his sword relentlessly at Lara Bolton's champion, beating them into submission. The gods have cast their judgment, and the prisoner is guilty. Executor, the gods demand it. Command it, sorry. Let her rot in the cell. She can stay here as my guest. Now, she was in the cell. And just because she wanted to try a comet doesn't mean she'd have death. We'll, rot. we'll let her rot in the cells. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I was going to give some places away. Okay, we need to give King's House. We've got Castle Cohen as well. And obviously the Dreadfort. High Lordship of the Dreadfort. Now obviously, who's part of the Dreadfort area? Okay, that's our area. Let's see if anyone in there is worthy of it. We've got Burley there. We've got Overton. Overton, maybe. Okay, the Overton has two. So it actually makes sense to give it to him. We'll give it to him. There we go. So now he's the High Lord of the Dreadfort. And King's House needs to go to someone. Ah, there we go. I thought maybe I had to wait until I could give it to him. There we go. He's now got King's House. And we'll keep the three we have at the moment until maybe someone particularly... Uh, takes my interest. My hand of the king, maybe. Do you know what? We'll give it to my hand of the king. We'll give him one of them. Master of White Harbor. Does he have like a city? Yes, he's a city. Okay, I can't make a. I'm not going to make a republic. Actually, <laughs> I always make that mistake. 
Okay, my prisoner, Lady Donella, the harmless mermaid, is complaining about her dark cell. Okay. I'll be merciful. I'm kind, after all. It's complaining about her dark cell. Okay, I'll be merciful. <laughs> okay, your vassal, Lord John Hayes of Flintsfinger, humbly asks for your help against the aggression of another vassal. I'll ask them to stand down. Hurry up, come on. Thank you. Hurry up. I want to start colonising that place. Again. Um, Leobald at Umbra's complaining about his dark cell. I'll let him rot for now. Maybe we should banish a couple of people. I'll have to check my cells in a second. In case we beat the ruins. <laughs> okay, you decreed that a new colony shall be established in the name of House Stark. All that is needed is a final order. Yes, start the colony. Yep. Oh, I actually had one less. Did not even notice that. Can't believe we've had to do it all over again. Um, what was I about to do? Oh yes, get with the armies. So that's all done. Uh, what is next then? Have to give that away. Okay. Gotta wait for that to be done. Ooh, the West we now have a claim on the Westlands and the Stormlands. Okay. Interesting. Are the Stormlands separate? Or what's going on here? What is going on? Okay. So still got a civil war going on. We could attack the Westlands right now. But I do have... My men are pretty depleted at the moment. It's probably best not to risk it. Oh, it's because we've lost... Okay, the Tully Lord died. Died comatose in bed. So we've got a very young Tully. Lord Paramount Louise. He's the regent. Okay, my wife's down there again. We'll have to wait till we get our friendship with them back up. I need to give him some places actually, don't I? Which one is it? Uh, transfer vassalage. Riverlander Frey. Huh. Why is he under me? No idea. Uh, Riverlander. That is probably yep. That was that was the one. Let's go with this then. Okay, so we give him to him. It's fine then. Robert of Green Fork. Uh, which one is it again? There, there is. Okay, Culture, Riverlander. Okay, Keith. That was you, wasn't it? Yep, the Green Fork. And that is done. There we go. And so the Riverlander's all back together. That's great. Making him our friend. That's great. Um... What else do I need to be doing? Can't believe... Oh, yep, my prisoners. That's what I wanted to look at. Um, Donella. Let's, uh... We'll leave her in jail. Same with White Harbour. Garth Stark. Now, you shouldn't be in jail for your father's... Uh, those, these are his blunders. We'll release you from prison. See, he likes us now. He likes us. Hopefully he won't rebel like his father. Helen? I don't know East Meld. Helen Stark. Yep, we're going to keep you in there, I think. Actually, do you know what? We're, we're going to send you off to uh, the Night's Watch. Okay, I can't do that. <laughs> Apparently, I can't send him to the Night's Watch. That's a shame. And I'm going to send... I can't do anything with her, can I? No. Damn it. Can't send her to the Night's Watch. And Leobald. Nah. Ah, there we go. Banish. That's what I wanted. Okay. We got you 20 gold. Yep, I think I'll banish him. 
It's a great honour to be part of the Night's Watch, as Bran can remember his own his own brother, Jon Snow, went to the Night's Watch. And obviously Benjen Stark as well. How did he die, actually? I've forgotten. Oh yes, he died of the dreaded plague. <laughs> like so many since that damn update. Luckily, I think the update's been fixed now, um, and hopefully that means no more of those bloody plagues. So that's the only descendant left of Jon Snow. Thistle. Nice, in interesting name. In interesting name. Helen Stark died in my dungeon. Okay, well, I guess he's not going to the wall then. Okay. Okay, as you can see, our armies are going up again. I'm going to wait until it goes a bit more before we make a move on any of the people we could possibly make a move on. Timian Martell. Timian Martell. Which ones are Timian? Okay. Then again, I guess we wouldn't actually get those places because... Oh, no, I guess we would do because of Palmancy. Yep, we would, actually. As I was say, if you try and claim, let's say, a title that's the same level, you won't be able to get it. You know, they won't be put under you. But obviously, the Palmancies are actually technically under these kings because these are sort of empire-level based titles, rather the Palmancies are actually king titles. So I think, I'm assuming they'd go under you. But if, let's say, if I did a claim for the Reach for someone and we won, the Reach would just be a separate entity. Oh, and it looks as though, damn, my grandson lost his position. The Tyrells gained it back. Okay, let's see what happened to my son. My grandson, sorry. He's now become the High Lord of Cockleswend. Okay, interesting. Interesting turn of events. The Fozaways have completely lost power. Duh, he died of a bloody flux. Ah. That's annoying. Was that the wrong one, actually? I looked the wrong one. I think I was looking at the wrong person. Oh, it's his brother. Yes, it was. Uh, was slain by Lord Alistair of Norcross in personal combat. Wow, okay. Only a few years ago. Damn, if he'd only last a bit... No, he must have been king at the time, so... That means he did become king. He has a strong claim on the Kingdom of the Reach. Awesome, but he's not obviously going to come to my court. Let a dark cell. Let a rot. Nope, he won't come. Oh well, which one's Cockles went? Ah, there we go. He's down here then. He's got quite a big bit of land. Uh, for Lord Harion's claim on the Reach. Oh, so he's fighting from old oh, dam. That might not be good. Okay, so my grandson's in a war for his own claim. He's got an okay bit of support, but it's not all of it. Is he winning? 5% in favour of the Reach. Okay, it's still early doors. Come on, grandson. If he could win that, that would be perfect. That would mean, obviously, he would in future inherit the North and the Reach, which would be awesome. So we'd have the whole, the whole area then we'd probably be the most powerful kingdom in the realm. Obviously the Greyjoys, well sorry, not the Greyjoys, the Good Brothers, obviously, would be giving us a run for our money. How are they doing anyway? They're still the Drowned God, are they going to try and turn everyone's religion? I wonder. Not sure if the computer really does much about that. Oh! And the Arryns lost control of the Vale to a Red Fort. Kim Michel or Michel has taken it. It's not good for them. I wonder if there's any Arons anymore. I have to check actually. I guess I could check on my one because we've got Sansa. Sansa's still alive. God rest her soul. The king died. How did he die? Died of the Great Plague. And his sister was in jail. His other sister 
is married to a Templeton. This isn't looking good for the Ammons. Yeah, Sunderland, he had no kids. Wow. The Ammons are not looking so good. Crown Loyalists, we've got a nice little group there. Not the biggest group, but it's okay so far. We've got prisoners in there. Military at the 66,000, that's great. That's sort of what we want at the moment. The Iron Throne is completely back together now. And he's still got it the same. He beat the rebellion against Primogeniture. Oh, and there's another war, it looks like. Blah, 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 blah. Western's war for Yendry's claim on the Iron Throne. Okay, so the... Damn, it looks as though the Iron Arts are in a real big problem trying to control the Iron Throne. Pike, ooh. That's part of the High Lordship of Pike. That is interesting. So is that. Wow, the High Lordship of Pike is pretty powerful. Wow. That is going to be a problem for him. Come on, how's your war going? Yes! We are winning. Awesome. The Arbor. I'm going to remember this Arbor. When we take the Reach and he inherits the North, you will remember this, Red Wains. Or Red Wine, sorry. We'll remember this. I, know, I used to always say it, uh, Red Wayne, but I think it's Red Wine, isn't it? I'm assuming it must be. That must be how you say it. I don't know why I said Red Wayne. Because that wouldn't make much sense. It doesn't, it doesn't look like that. Okay, looks like they have a big problem holding it. They'll probably lose that, to be honest. And he gave the, the Iron Isles away. Who's he giving the Iron Isles to? Let's have a look. Okay, no one has the Iron Isles. He's actually in the war as well, it looks like. No, he's not. Is he separate? The Iron Throne. Pike? Okay, maybe, they, they, maybe they've not joined either side. So it looks like he destroyed the title of the Iron Isles. Which is very interesting. Maybe he didn't like the whole thing of, you know, elective sort of monarchy, so he got rid of it just to get rid of the confusion. Okay, interesting. Basically a good brother who's not... He's called the Holy. Okay. But he's not really... He's not really in with his, I guess, his culture's background for their kingship. He doesn't like that. I guess he just wants the whole sort of, you know, I'm absolute monarchy. That's probably what he wants. Okay, now we get to declare war on the Iron Throne as well. But the Iron Throne obviously wouldn't help because it's a similar title. We could declare war on the Westlands. That's a question. Do you want to declare war on the Westlands? How's the war going? A few percent in favour of the Iron Throne, okay. So the question is, do I want to declare war on the Westlands? I guess I do. I guess I kind of do. Because I'm assuming he becomes under me, because apparently that will mean Timon Martell will be under me, under my thumb. I would assume. I would assume. But again, what I assume could be completely wrong. Completely wrong. Huh. Guess we could just do it. Yeah, might as well. We got a lot of men now. I'm gonna do it. 